Take out us WhatsApp. Hope you are doing great. This video, I'm gonna discuss about the most important topic. Next to your hiring. For getting started, do subscribe to the channel. There are the three important things that you need to keep take take care of. We want to get shortlisted after applying any company. Let me explain what will be happen after after we apply to a company. This next web portal, the recruiter will consider three important things, which are skill profile, mock interview score, and offline assessment score. I have already made a video on these two things, which are mock interview score. And uh, offline assessment experience as well. Do check out those links in the description. Let's get started. Coming to this uh, skill profile, we need to increase the skill profile to get shortlisted in the recruiting process. So, where we need to get a B grade in all the course exams. So that we need to plan accordingly by writing the course exam details and uh, which day we have which course exam. I have made a detail sheet on the schedule of this uh, course exams. Yeah, here we have the course exam schedules. Uh, we have three exams on Sunday. Responsive web design using Checkbox, uh, Developer Foundation course, and Programming Foundation is Python, as we know. And on Monday, we have static website designing, uh, Responsive web design on Tuesday, and a React course exam on Wednesday, and a Node.js course exam on Thursday. And Friday, we have dynamic web applications. On Saturday, we have two exams which are uh, JavaScript Essentials and Introduction to Databases. Just QL. It's better to take a screenshot and use it for your reference. So, every single week, you can write exam each time. So, do not neglect because it is very important to. Clear this course exams with a B grade or more, get shortlisted in the interview process. One small tip from my side to clear these exams like uh, going to the My Journey. Check the previous assignment test, test questions uh, just, uh, respect to tech stack because uh, almost 90% of the questions will be taken from there. For example, let me explain on to web design in Flexbox. This so we can write uh, any number of times the uh, npq test 1 so we can check the review attempt review mistakes and we can note down this uh, answers and use it for the course exams most of the questions will be repeated from here so it's better to write uh, any number of times npq test and note down the answer as, as they have displayed here Can write any number of times and check the answers this way. So it will be easy while writing the course exam. When we got the same questions, we can directly choose these answers. Check uh, as as many questions as possible. 
the assignment questions which are MCQ type as we also have MCQ assignment test we can check from here by writing any number of times because they have given the review mistake option to check the answers if you are not sure about the answers this way they are correct then we can use this code the code playground and uh, get the answers get the answers for this particular questions the same way we can also check the mcq assignment too. You can write any number of times as i have attempted uh, here and check the answers for this particular question only red flag we have on this uh, course exams are they will not uh, enable the review attempt option to check the answers which have kept wrong so it's better to follow the process which i have explained earlier this way we can clear the course exams the good score Thank you. All the best for your interviews. Do subscribe to the Being Pro Coder. See you in next week.